Hey guys, Sean here at Mahalo.com, and today I'm going to show you how to use the snipping tool and sticky notes in Windows 7. Today I'm going to show you some handy tools that come built with Windows 7. The first tool is a snipping tool. It is a great tool to capture any part of the screen. To use it, simply click on the start menu, and type in the search column, snipping, and then hit enter. Now with the snipping tool open, you can use your mouse to capture anything on the screen just by dragging a box around it. This is useful if you want to catch an error message, for instance. When you have your image in the snipping tool, you can use the pen to mark it, the highlighter to highlight items, and if you want to remove anything, just use the eraser. From the snipping tool, you can also email and save. And all that makes for a pretty handy tool to have. One more built-in tool is Sticky Notes. Sticky Notes is simply a digital version of Post-it Notes for Windows 7. To launch Sticky Notes, just open the Start menu, then select All Programs, then Accessories, then Sticky Notes. Once Sticky Notes is open, just click on a note and start typing. If you want another note, just click on the plus symbol on the upper left. And if you'd like to close a note, just click on the X in the upper right. Now if you want to change the color of your Sticky Note, just right click on it and select another color from the list. There are also a few keyboard shortcuts you should know for Sticky Notes. Like for instance, if you wanted your text bold, use the keyboard shortcut Control plus B to italicize Control plus I to underline Control plus U to strike through Control plus T and if you'd like to make a list with bullet points, you can use the shortcut Control plus Shift plus L. Also, if you restart your computer with sticky notes open, the notes will be right where you left them when you start your computer back up. And there you have it. You now know how to use the snipping tool and sticky notes in Windows 7. To stay connected to this learning course, make sure to subscribe and feel free to rate and comment below. And thanks for watching.